Happy holidays! Here's my social media. Check out my Roblox group and merch. Hey everyone, Ashley Bunny here and today, guys, finally I'm finishing a series. We are back with my SimSelf series that I started um let me actually check when i started this series so i started this series a year ago may 23rd 2021 so actually over a year ago and i just never finished it i just never finished my sim series i started focusing more on royal high i mean i've always focused on royal high but i mean i kind of just like ditch that series for more royal high videos but now i think i'm gonna start meshing them together sims and royal high videos because i don't want to leave my sims in the dust because i still love sims and i love recording it so yeah here's our sim girl this is i forgot her name i think her name is ashley bunny it is ashley bunny so this is our sim self series and if i remember correctly yeah she has a few love interests she has santa claus and she has this man well, that's actually not my business now because I don't actually want her to be with him. And what's going on over here? What's going on at the cafe? Oh, wow. Is this like broken and dirty? Who would ever want to order something from a nasty restaurant? Also, whoever scone this is, they're not getting it. I'm going to go eat that. Yes, she stole the food. Sorry, Lily Fang. She is a thief and a half. I'm going to wait for someone to order food, then I'm going to steal it. Yep, slide this my way. Oh, let's drink with desperation. Oh, no. Oh, no. The guy we kissed. He took it. No, give that to me. Yes. We are a crook. Look at her enjoying that. She's like, mm, how delish. I did want to give her a makeover. Actually, let's just go home and use the restroom. This is going to take too long. Okay, go ahead and go home. You're clearly, um, what? Um, guys, <laughs> did anybody see that? Okay, now that she's back home in her teeny tiny apartment, she's going to go ahead and use the restroom and then she's just going to go to sleep. I mean, who cares about her fun, right? You can have fun in your dreams. All right, go to bed. Also, let's get these lights off because we don't want the bill to be too high. Okay, Santa Claus, no, we do not want to go to the retail store with you. Like what? I hate when they ask her to go to like clothing stores on a date. Like when, what? Go ahead and get left though. Actually, no, just just have brunch. Since you woke up during brunch time, just, just go ahead and have, oh wow, she is very irritated. She did not have to slam that door like that. Okay, uh, calm down. Uh, we get it. Like, why is she doing all that? Relax. Just eat your, I get it, you're tense and you don't have fun, but calm down. You know what? Actually, watch TV. She wants to kiss someone from her soulmate aspiration. I forgot we have an aspiration. Okay, so she's already been on one date and that was in episode one. Uh, let's go ahead and let's try to get her on another date pretty soon here and also i do have a reshade on let me know if you guys want the reshade i don't know how i was playing sims without a reshade all this time i really don't know how also the reason i was romancing sand claws are they protesting outside guys it's one in the afternoon don't, don't you have work it's a monday don't you have work yeah, i know they have work mortimer and what's his name bjorn bjorgson i know you guys have work she needs fun like really bad so she's gonna actually what are they even protesting what is it save the plants uh let's let's watch the protest maybe that'll put her fun up no this is clearly not entertaining her boring conversation she just said hey okay she's still going at it all by herself she has something to say and is this the same old woman from the last episode who's still out here I respect the hustle, I do. Why is he looking at her like that? Why are they slowly moving their heads? This is scary, I don't want anything to do with that. I really don't. Is this our guy friend? It is. He looks um interesting. I really don't know what to say, I don't. But she is gonna go flirt with him because that's her little boo thing for now. I don't think this is her forever. Didn't she already kiss him? Why is it saying she can't kiss him? Like she literally just went on a date with him where she kissed him. Oh, he doesn't want her. Wow, that's actually really embarrassing. And she's a loner. No, I forgot. Why did I make her a loner? I mean, I like being alone, but I'm not like, this. Is, why did I give her that trait? Can't stand to be around strangers. I don't think I can't stand to be around strangers. You know what I think? Actually, this is a perfect time to go ahead and go through with the makeover. And let's go ahead and turn on the cheeky doodles so we can go ahead and modify her and cast. So the first thing we're gonna do is actually get rid of that loner trait. What should we change it to? I think she should be loyal. Yeah, loyal, I think that's, I'm, I'm pretty loyal. Here is my, actually, let's check out her outfits before we actually give her the big makeover. Um, ew, um, pff, don't know why I did. Does anyone know why I put this on her? 
Um, this was a year ago, over a year ago. That was a whole different me. Yeah, I don't know what the deal is with her fits. This is the only cute one. Um, yeah, this one is interesting. Let's go ahead and give her a makeover and I'll be right back. Whoosh. And here is the finished product, guys. Here is my Sim. This is her after her makeover, Ashley Bunny, and she's so cute. Guys, I love her. So I changed her up basically completely. I mean, I changed her face a little bit because it was looking a little wonky. Gave her some new hair. I gave her new everything basically. So here is her everyday wear. Very cute, very me. And here is her formal wear. I also added like custom eyes for her everyday wear. I think I'm gonna take those off because like I just don't feel like putting them on the other outfits. But here's the formal wear, her wedding. And here's her other formal for like parties and stuff. And then we have athletic, we have sleepwear, little onesie, then we have party wear for like nights out on the town. Then we have her swimsuit, which I actually have this, like this swimsuit cover in real life. So yeah, that's pretty cool. And here is her hot weather outfit, cute, more pink of course. And then we have her winter wear which literally i made the same except i just added some tights because it was too cute to change so yeah let's go ahead and get back to the gameplay okay here we are in the gameplay and she's still embarrassed because i guess she just said something he didn't enjoy i don't know you know he he's married we're done talking to him i know last episode we said it didn't matter but i mean it kind of does oh she's a pretty sim i added a mod that's supposed to make my sims like my randomized townies look a little better yeah you know what she's not having fun so you know what she's gonna do she's gonna go back home oh um what babe what is the cause what, what, what are you protesting that's what I want to know is what are you actually protesting? And why is Jeffrey Langrab here <laughs> joining in the party? Oh, he literally joined the party. Oh, here we have Jesminder Bita. She has twins in like every save file I have. I don't, let me check if she's actually having twins. Either a boy or twins. She always has them. Yeah, she has one boy. Okay. She either has like a boy or like literally just randomly twins every time without fail. Okay, Ashley, stop protesting. Um, that was not fun for you. I don't know why you did that. Let's get a job. I don't know if we got a job before. Yeah, let's go ahead and join a career. And I think she's gonna be, let's see, something with computers. Yeah, she's gonna be a tech guru. So does she have to do anything for her job currently? Oh, play video games. Perfect. Just go back to the apartment and let's, let's buy her some video games. Let's, let's get her, uh, let's see. Don't we, I think we have in my game, I think I have like a PS4. Yeah, this is the PS4 <laughs> or the Play 4 by Future Q. Let's make it, um, well, that's kind of red. Okay, let's just, let's just leave it there. That's cute. We also have a curved TV for 3000. I almost want to get that. Like, I want to get that so bad. I don't know. The rug is kind of throwing me off. I think I'm going to have to do a makeover of this whole house. And I'll probably just come back to you guys like next episode with like a new house or not a new house or like a newly decorated apartment, I mean. Um, but yeah, let's just go ahead and make this, make it kind of comfy for now. So yeah, she's going to go ahead and play some video games, play an online game with, um, let's see. Oh, she has a lot of friends. Let's play with Candy and Travis Scott. I didn't know she had that many friends. How interesting. Like, and the relationship is like really high. So she enjoys playing video games a lot so her fun's gonna go up pretty quickly yeah she is having fun oh I get, did she lose what is she playing we bowling or no that's basketball I don't know what's going on here oh she did lose the game wow that's kind of embarrassing guys oh Santa Claus is calling her try a new career no why would you ever want to not be Santa Claus that is so that's sick I kind of want to get her pregnant by Santa Claus because I'm fine with her being a single mom but I also do want like an established household. But I want to have a baby with Santa Claus because they get a buff. Like your children get a buff when you have a baby with Santa. So I don't know. I think she should just have a baby with him and then go have children with like the person she's meant to be with. You know what I mean? Is that crazy? Let's invite him over anyway. Let's see what Santa Claus is up to. Santa. Okay, let's say, let's oh, let's ask him to be our boyfriend so we can get that for our aspiration. There we go. And let's just ask him on a date. And let's, the date's gonna be here because I don't feel like um, going out. Do you know what I mean? So flirt with your date. Flirt and let's see. Oh, there's a new interaction. Express devotion. How cute. I have so many mods in my game. I don't know if the loyal trait is actually from the Sims updates 
or it's like from a mod, I don't know. But let's go ahead and watch TV together. And let's turn on the romance channel, let's see. Why is he not watching TV with me? Stop talking and watch the TV. He's not watching TV with me. How rude. Watch TV with me. Okay, finally. I'm like, why is he not watching? <laughs> Look at how he scooted over. You're not slick, Clement. You're not slick. No, they always want to get on my computer. No, stop it. Get off, Clement. You can't get on. Get off. I'm not going to let him do that, y'all. Every single time, without fail, these sims get on my computer. I don't know what is with the coding. I don't know what the problem is that idle sims that aren't a part of your household just go to the computer. But that needs to stop. Like yesterday, that needs to stop. Okay, let's just, oh, we can propose? Let's not do that. That's a little, that's a bit much. Oh, wow. That, that wow, that's interesting. Let's go ahead and, oh, whoa. <laughs> Should we do it? I gotta think about this. I want my sims, like their children to be cute and Clement is just, not that you know what i mean but it's okay we'll we'll do it anyway she's gonna have a child guys episode two she's gonna be pregnant wait do i want this guys i gotta think does she want children have i ever stopped to consider that maybe she doesn't want this maybe she doesn't want children well i know she wants children because she's me but does she want children with this man okay no 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 stop don't do it no get out of there okay guys i bailed out i bailed out let's just actually no i forgot i think i have risky for woo who on so i can't even do that uh let's just end the date that's awkward she changed her mind bye clement she doesn't want anything to do with you she thought she wanted a child with you but now she doesn't i mean he's always gonna be around right clement frost you're he's always gonna be santa claus so i mean it's nothing crazy going on there oh wow i'm glad that she went out today because she woke up at 5 a.m. Perfect. That is just, that is a great morning routine you have. Getting up at 5 a.m. and starting your day. Oh, you also stink. Ew. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna take this bath and I'm gonna, let's make it a shower and a bath. I always have to have a shower bath in all my Sims households because I feel like baths take so long in The Sims. Like, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh, she's on fire, guys. Why is she on fire? This this is sick. Whatever is going on here in the Sims, this is sick. Why is she, oh, look at her face. Okay, okay, okay. Oh my gosh, she is in so much distress. Okay, actually extinguish yourself. Go, extinguish yourself. Oh my gosh, I thought she was gonna die. Oh my goodness. Wait, what does this say? Fires can be a vital source of heat or a calming warmth on a cold night. Ashley saw firsthand the more destructive side of fire. Ashley never wants to see that again. So what's, this is strange. She got singed, fire is out. Thank goodness the fire is over. And she has a looming dread from fear of fire. That dreadful feeling looms over Ashley as she discovers something new about herself. A fear that wasn't there before growing inside ready to overcome Ashley into paralysis at any moment. She has a fear of fire. I didn't know Sims could have like fears. Like my Sim children in my other worlds would have fears of like the dark, but I didn't think it was this complex. Can she actually clean the, the mess? Like what, why is she cleaning nothing? This is not dirty. And how this didn't burn, I don't know. Uh, well, any wow, she has a new trait. Fear of fire. Ashley will want to run away and hide from fire and has an increased chance of starting fires accidentally. That sucks so bad. I want to remove that trait and cheat so bad, but that's like really interesting. I didn't know that was in game. That's crazy. Now she's scared and she's having a scared shower. Well, let's just get a quick meal. You know what I mean? Actually, no. Matter of fact, let's just get leftovers. Oh my gosh, she is running scared. She's gonna she's gonna take a panic poop. That poor girl. Oh. Ashley, I'm so sorry. I didn't know. I didn't know. Look at her. Now she's looking over her shoulder. Even on the toilet, she is paranoid. That's sick. That is a, it's a sick world we live in. That is crazy. And who's this? Miss Pregnant. She's still pregnant. Oh my gosh. Extinguish fire from fear of fire. Fire left unchecked will engulf everything in its path. Ashley has seen it happen once before. Well, that's a lie, because it didn't really do any damage, you know what I mean? It just left a dirty floor. Will she let it happen again, or will she extinguish it in time? You know what, I think I would develop a fear on fire if I myself 
caught on fire. I think that's a valid reason to have a fear of fire. If I was literally burning alive. Anyways, I think I want her to really find love. I do. Um, she does, her boyfriend is Santa. Um, that's kind of awkward, I'm not gonna lie. I think I'm actually gonna create her a soulmate. Even though I like finding them authentically in game, I think I am just gonna make her a soulmate, like artificially make her a soulmate because I'm tired of her being by herself. I am. Also, oh, she has work in two hours. That is so interesting and she hasn't even done her daily task. And actually when she finishes doing all of this and she goes to work, I think that's when I'm gonna end the episode because yeah, she has work in like 10 minutes. So, oh, video games are complete, okay. Okay, get off the game. You have to go to work now. Oh, the Geek Con is in town from 10 a.m. to 4 p.m. Yeah, it's gonna be over by the time we get back from work. I really wanted her to go to Geek Con though. Should she skip the first day of work? Yes, she should. And she's not bringing anyone. She's gonna go by herself. She's gonna skip work. Hey, but when I get to the festival, I'm gonna call in sick so they don't suspect anything. You know, I'm just gonna say, you know, things happen. Even though it is the first day of work, I'm just gonna say I got sick. I'm just gonna say my house caught on fire. I'm gonna say I caught on fire, which I mean, which is not a lie, that's true. Aw, I don't know what she's wearing. Oh, this was her work clothes, okay. Well, ew. Let's go ahead and call in fake sick. And let's see if they believe us. Come on, what do they say, what do they say? Who's, okay, hold on. Um, <laughs> There's a lot to unpack here. Is this Jeffrey Langrab? Oh no, wait. Oh my gosh, it is. I knew that head shape anywhere, you guys, you don't know how much I play The Sims that I knew, I knew this was Jeffrey from the, the head shape alone. Even with this costume on, I knew it was him. Literally just from this head shape, from this shot, I knew it was Jeffrey. I literally knew it. But yeah, I knew this is Jeffrey. That's actually quite scary that they actually have this in game. Is this from like Star Wars or something? Listen, I don't know about all that, but let's see if they believed her. You don't sound so- oh, they don't believe her. My house really did catch on fire though. Oh, let's just take a vacation day. Give me my day off, man. She's still scared. Oh, that's gonna go away in a second. Actually, let's go ahead and get up our rocket science skill because I wanted her to have her own rocket when she gets her own house. So, cause she wants to go to the stars. She loves space. So let's go ahead and get that rocket skill up. Oh, wait, there's a finished one right there. Yes, so she has the rocket science skill level two, in fact. How interesting. She's actually gonna do the ultimate gaming test even though I know she's not that good at video games yet. She's still gonna do the test and then she's gonna go explore space. And then we're gonna end the episode. I know I said I was gonna end the episode after we got here, but I lied. <laughs> oh, she's playing, oh, messy. <laughs> Look at her playing soccer. Oh, whoa, what's, what's this? Uh, the fix it Felix run. The minimum total score to pass is 70. <gasps> She got a 30. That's actually embarrassing. You know what? Just leave. Just go to space. Yeah. Just say goodbye to the world. Oh, and there she goes. Moving day. Passing the planet Yang. Ashley sees a wary looking alien standing amid a huge pile of trash bags and rusty futon parts. Turns out he's moving to a new pad on the planet Romp. Peter Romperter and his friend who was supposed to help just bailed. Ashley's got some extra time. Should she pitch in? Well, it seems like I have no other choice. A lot of junk. Good thing Ashley has an expanded cargo bay. It's a lot of stuff to move. Old concert tees, milk crate furniture, black light posters, but it all fits in pretty easily and they blast off her rompeter. The alien is so grateful he gives Ashley his least dirty futon mattresses. Thanks. Ashley incinerates it. A futon, thank you, I appreciate it, but no, I don't think I'll be using a used futon. Oh, level three of the rocket science skill. I didn't know you built rocket science skills while in space. Okay, Ashley, I think it's your cue to come back now. What you, what's going on here? What are you doing? Oh my gosh, they're like almost done with this. These people are working like busy bees. And this girl is still pregnant. It's been days. She's been in trimester three for like three days. Just go ahead and have the baby. Oh my gosh, I got level four rocket science. Oh my goodness. Wait, Cecilia Kang won? Doesn't she live in the cottage living town? What's it called? Henford on Bagley, doesn't she live there? They don't even have Wi-Fi. How does she win the hackathon? Okay, Ashley, I think it's time to come back now. It's, it's like at full. The bar is full. When is she coming back? Oh! Speak of the devil, here she is. She has safely returned from exploring the cosmos. Look at her, she is proud of herself. Oh my gosh, Jeffrey Landcraft. Oh wait, that's not him. 
Who's this? And why do we know him? I'm just gonna go ahead and end the episode. I am quite scared being here. There's costumes I've never seen. There's people in my face, you know. I'll just go ahead and change to her regular fit and end the episode. She's so cute, aww. Anyways, guys, that is going to be the end of the episode. This is a wrap for episode two of my Sim Self series. I am reviving it because I want to record and upload The Sims. I'm still gonna be doing a bunch of Royal High, but I do wanna throw in some Sims videos here and there. So anyways, guys, if you did enjoy, please do make sure to hop on that like button, comment down below, and subscribe to become a bunny and to join the bunny garden. This has been your girl Ashley Bunny here. Bye. Mwah.